Hello and welcome to Take Me Through Your Day. I know it's been a long time. This episode and the next episode are going to be cut short. They're going to be little mini episodes, just, you know, five, ten minutes, whatever. Just there's a lot of pre-COVID stuff, a lot of stuff didn't work. Uh, They might be edited later. They'll all be available eventually. I promise you that. They're all very good. Especially this one. This one is a hospital parking attendant. And there's so much, there's so many heartfelt stories and so many interesting things that happen in this episode. I, I hate to just not air it, but for the sake of getting things back on track, I'm just going to give you a little teaser right now. And then we're going to get right back to putting out normal episodes. I mean, not right back. The next episode's going to be one of these too, real short. But still, very fun. Back on track. Everything's going to be really cool. I think you'll I think you'll enjoy it. It's not you know, it, it just it, it's like I said, it's just a teaser. I don't know where we're going to put it out later. But we'll figure it out later. Um right back to normal if uh you or anyone you know like to be on the show you could reach us at take me tyd at gmail.com or at take me tyd on all social media i really hope you enjoy this little clip thanks I mean, we, we talked about it earlier, so I, I don't really know how to touch on it, but can you talk about that at all? Because it, it, it's, it's pretty insane. Right. I personally wasn't there when he had gotten shot or when he had been rushed to the hospital. Um, but a lot of my friends were there um, working and everything like that. And it was, it was crazy. It was... There are people crying and everyone was just sitting there. And it's just, it's hard to see people's family in all of that pain. Like you sit there and think, what if it had been my family and everything like that? Like I pers- I, I can't speak for other people I work with because I don't know how they feel. But personally, I, I sit there and think every possible scenario. What mm-hmm. if it had been me? Mm-hmm. What if it had been my friends? Like... How are they feeling? Um, and when you do your orientation, they make you they have you they have you watch an empathy video. And it's kind of like how to handle situations like that. Because as a valet, we just park your cars. We, but as a valet, you had to watch this empathy video? Yes, because I mean I'm very are, curious about that. Can we I mean, just talk about that for a minute? Yeah, I mean you you don't just open someone's door for them and say, hi, how are you today? You're walking into the emergency room. Hi, how are you? You know, it's it's not, oh, I'm good, thank you. How are you? It's most time, I mean, I've gotten responses like, honestly, you don't want to ask. Today's not my day. Um, yeah, honestly, I could be better. Getting, you're not getting right. people so, on their best so day. You, so you try to kind of think, the point of the empath- empathy video is kind of like, Look at it from their perspective. Look how, try to figure out how you can make their visit a little bit better than what it's going to be. Um, that actually, that's really great. I, I wouldn't have expected that from uh, just a valet service. I mean, we're the first people you see when you walk in the door. We're standing right outside the front. The no, front I, no, of I the get that. Room, it's so. fantastic that you do it. I just mean like. The company that I'm yeah. with, I... <laughs> I've honestly never been as satisfied with a company that I've worked for as I am with the company that I work for now. I mean... Yeah, they sound pretty awesome. We try to make the best of every situation. We try to make your visit wherever you are, whether it's a hotel, a restaurant, private party, um, hospital. We try to make it as best as we can for you because at the end of the day, it's not about us working and making money it's about you and if your stay is as best as we can make it really 